Hey there folks, it's Steve Toonster again. We're gonna play some more Rhythm Heaven Fever. And the next four games I did superb in practice. Whether or not I can replicate that in the actual LP, I cannot say. We're gonna start off with Tap Troop though, or I think it's pronounced Troop. Pardon my French. This game reminds me a lot of Lockstep. Simply because of the fact that you keep a constant beat a lot of the time. But it's also a bit different from lockstep. There's no like big transitions or anything. One, so let's actually look at two, what's going on here. One, two, three, four. This is just normal keeping time. It's weird how you can like see their feet in one area and then the rest of their bodies in the other. Puts a weird perspective there. Almost got out of step. But I'm good. This is pretty easy. This isn't the hard part of the game at all. It's this next part that can be a little tricky sometimes, one, but even it's not that bad. One, two, three, four. So we're going to get it ready, and then we're going to hit all the off beats. Bomb, three, bomb, four, bomb, five, bomb, six, bomb, seven, bomb, eight, bomb, nine, ten, bomb, ten. Bomb, ten. And that tap, tap, tap at the end. So when we go back to normal beats. So we'd be keeping time after that. Oops, let's try this. Bum, 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 bum. Tap, tap, tap. Yeah. Wait, that wasn't perfect? I must have messed up at the beginning. Dang it. It's one slight mistake and they won't take it. Let's get it this time. Tap, tap, tap. There we go. <laughs> yeah, every time you do it, they'll go, okay. All in perfect unison. Oh, we're not quite done yet. I thought that was it. Oh, this must just be the transition part. Oh, it's a lot shorter. I guess it's just to show you that there's varying lengths of time that you do that. That was horrible. Three more? Jeez. I guess these aren't that long, though. Yeah, we got it. I'm not quite sure if that tap, tap, tap is all like the same length of time in, in between the beats. It kind of seems like the last one's a little bit quicker. I don't know why. Maybe it's just an illusion. Auditory illusion. Whoa. Boom, boom, boom. Yeah. What are they showing here? I guess it's just showing that you can go straight into the tap, tap, tap. You don't have, have to have any of the bomb, bomb, bombs. Bomb, bomb, bombs. All right, we got it. Okay, you're finally ready to play the actual game. Yeah, he said break a leg. Oh boy, I might actually do that. One, two, three, four. Yeah. So be keeping time here for quite a while, or maybe not. What are you doing, a raspberry? They do that every time you mess up. Mess up big, that is. Yeah. Okay. We can do this. Bum, bum, tap, tap, tap. Music's starting to kick in a little bit more. It's nice that we always get a cue. Sometimes it can be invasive though. Just doesn't mix well with the music. Yeah, yeah, yeah. See, it seems like it hit the last tap a little bit quicker than normal. Bum, 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 bum. Tap, tap, tap. I don't know, maybe it's just me. Do this. That was a long one. Ugh! I always tricky with that one. I always miss that one. Yeah. What the heck? You firing off, confetti? Happy Chinese New Year, everybody! Yeah. Whoa. Oh man. Oh, that one's hard to admit. It's like slower than usual, it seems, on that one. Don't know why, they don't give you any warning. Yeah. Heard laughing in the background, did you hear that? Yeah. Bring it home, fellas. Hear the tap troop. Tap. Okay. You know these guys party, man. 
that's it. What the? Holy crap! How can you guys do that if you're that tall? How do you not fall over? Just an okay. Alright, I'm fine. I'm not gonna complain. I'm not gonna complain about the fact that we haven't had a superb in like two tiers of games. Yeah, I, I say you would. You did did it, guys. You did did it. You did do it. Enough about that. Let's move on to the next game. Shrimp Shuffle. This is a pretty odd game. Gotta say. This is another game that focuses a lot on transitions. In the beat, kind of takes a little while to get used to, but once you do get used to it, it's like second nature. So this is how it goes. Together, one, two, whoops, three, two, one, one, two, three, three, two, one, just that. Whoops, start too early. Oh man, hard to keep this beat and talk. One, two, three, three, two. It's not your simple four, four anymore. Yeah. One more. Okay, nice. And the together really helps you, helps start things off, if you kind of like get off track. So the next mechanic here is instead of 1, 2, 3 at the end, there will be A, B, C. And on the C, you hit A and B. 1, 2, 3, A, B, C. It's like we're playing a kindergartner game, man. Learning the 1, 2, 3s and A, B, Cs. Oh! And not to get hit by shrimp. Ugh! One, two, three, three, B, C. They make it sound like he messed up at the end when you do the A and B. I gotta do this. Two, one, come on. One, two, three, A, B, C. We got, really gotta do it one more time. I wish I didn't have to do the whole thing even when I mess up. Because it doesn't count anyway. Come on. Two, three, A, B, C. Finally. And there's one more little tricky mix-up they have here. There's a slight pause that happens. It's probably easier to just watch and find out. One, two, three. So that short pause. Ugh, why'd I mess it up again? One, two, three, three, two, one. And then you start the next phrase a little bit faster than normal. I really can't do this while talking. This is going to be fun. Okay, that's actually the last mechanic, so I'm just going to skip on ahead here. And do my best on this game. Nice dolphins in the background. One, two, three, hey. Oh, not ABC yet. Oh my goodness. Three, two, one. Together? I hope so. First ABC. Luckily, there's not a lot of the third mechanic in this game. Oh my god. You're gonna notice that all my mistakes are when I'm talking. My body's rhythm. Can't play this and talk at the same time. I almost wonder why I decided to LP this. There we go. I caught that. No. I made a lot of mistakes already. Uh. Thing is, when you bump into one of them, you bump into the next one. I wonder if that counts as two mistakes. C. One, two, three, A, B, C. Ugh. One, two, three. Ugh. Okay. <laughs> This is the first time I've ever had to, like, quit in the middle of the game, because I'm pretty sure I was going to fail that, and I didn't want to waste any more time. i got to find out how I can lock on that beat. And, like, open my mouth at the same time. It's a lot harder than it seems. i got to do my best, though. One, two, three. Let's listen to the music. It's all about threes. One, two, three. Three. That makes it a little bit easier, I guess. Whoops! I totally forgot the C. Oh well. One mistake so far. I'm doing a bit better this time. 
until that. Oh my god. Okay, got that C. Stop trying to start early. Doesn't work. <laughs> got the pause. Whoops. Tried to hit C for some reason. Or, you know, the B C. Just keep it flowing. Doing a lot better than last time, that's for sure. Yeah. Get into the chorus. Ooh, they tried to chain them together. Kind of got me there. I don't know. Still made a lot of mistakes. But we can recover. One, two, three, A, B, C. All done. I hope I pass that. <laughs> that's all I can say. Really good. Oh, okay. He gave me a compliment, so that's a good sign. Goody, goody. That was a lot tougher than I thought it was going to be. There's no I in prawn. What kind of phrase is that? I guess that's their equivalent when you're a shrimp. Cheer readers. This is a neat game. I'm actually a pretty big fan of this one. Just the way they utilize all the mechanics and chain them together is really nice. Oh, and if you weren't paying attention to the description, they were talking about how they're trying to encourage people at the library to study. They're the school library pep squad. Why they spent money to organize this, I have no idea. Maybe it actually works. Is there any school in this world that actually does this? That'd be weird. So let's go on to the, get on to the actual rhythm game here. You get one, two, three. We're the character on the bottom right, of course. And on the three, that's when you just hit A and flip your card. Nothing to it, man. The next pattern's slightly more tricky, but not that much. So it's a four. One, two, three, four. And then four, that's when you hit it. Still pretty simple, huh? It gets a little bit more tricky. So what's going on this time? I'm not, I wasn't paying attention. Oh, okay. <laughs> Let's go read a bunch of books! Oh my gosh. That translation. That translation. Oh, nice. Thanks for the compliment here in the tutorial. I could really use that. So yeah, we had the ra ra sisku ba boom and on the boom, that's when we hit A. And then on the books of Let's Go Read a Bunch of Books, that's when we hit it. This here, after the OK, you hold A and B, and then release it like right before you finish that on. So that way you're in perfect sync, and you'll notice that that's one of the robots from... Oh jeez, I forget the name of the game, but it's the robot game from Rhythm Heaven on the DS. And you'll, feel, you'll see a lot of those references when we do those OK It's Ons, so pay attention. Now to the actual game. Got lyrics on the bottom. Sing along. One, two, three. All right. Doing good. Yeah. Now we're the only ones singing now, or shouting. That's okay, I like our character's voice. Boom. Let's go read a bunch of books. So yeah, as you can see, I've kind of memorized this. Yeah. See how they chain them together, though? It's pretty cool. Really get into a nice rhythm. Boom. Yeah. Nothing can trick us, man. Except that. <laughs> Whiffing a few. Quite a few. Hey, it's the DJs. Boom, boom. Lockstep. Second reference to lockstep. Whoops, that was way too early. Not quite done yet. Yeah. Back to a more slow part. Boom. It's on! Mr. Onion, from the very first Rhythm Tengoku game. 
Yay, great cheering, but still just okay. You don't even tell us why, it's just okay. Yeah, It's because I whiffed a lot of them, that's why. I burn with a desire to study. You'll never see that in American school system, man. Pretty much any school system for that matter. Oh, well, we got an opportunity to perfect monkey watch. Should I try it and fail again like last time? Well, I think I will try it again, but I won't fail. I won't fail this time. I'll see you guys at victory. For victory! I guess I failed again, guys. Oh man. I was really looking forward to getting a perfect there. Actually, why am I even trying to do that? Because, well, here's an update on how I'm going to be doing the perfects here. As you can see, I'm not making very good progress here on this file. So what I've decided to do is, I've already got all the medals on my other file. So I'm just going to start getting all the perfects on there. I've already got 10 so far. And then we'll just see what that brings us here at the end. Even though I was going to make that sort of a surprise, but eh, whatever. It's no use keeping it from you guys. So next time we're going to start things off with Karate Man. Getting, like, we're two games. This is actually the very last unique game. I was talking about last time. Uh, the seventh tier is the last unique row of games. But we don't have to worry about that because there's still a lot more content to go through. So we'll start on it next time. I'll see you guys then. Thanks for watching.